Hey guys, welcome back to the channel that teaches you how to make Procreate brushes. Continuing our artist series, here's a brush that will help you create your own digital masterpieces in the style of this iconic artist, the Impasto Van Gogh brush. It's a brush that creates a multi-dimensional stroke that you can layer on top of each other for a distinct impasto effect. It's a brush that has built-in color dynamics so you can use one color and achieve a multi-dab paint look. I'll teach you how to create the brush with built-in brush shapes and textures to create both a multi-dab brush to fill in larger areas and a single dab brush for more detailed work. So let's get started and make this brush. We'll first create the multi-dab brush, so let's start with an open canvas, choose a brush library, and tap on the plus sign to make a new brush. In Stroke Path, set Stroke Property Spacing to 35%. In Shape, tap on Edit beside Shape Source, go into the library, and choose Oil Dash. Before exiting, let's rotate the brush horizontally. Tap Done to save shape. Under Shape Behavior, set Scatter to 40%, Rotation to follow Stroke, and Count to 4. Down here, turn on both Flip X and Flip Y. In Grain, go into the Grain Source Library, and choose Acrylic Mix. Tap Done twice to save grain. Under Grain Behavior, set Scale to 20% and Brightness to 30%. In Rendering, set Rendering Mode to Heavy Glaze. In Color Dynamics, let's set Stamp Color Jitter Hue to 5% lightness to 20%, and darkness to 10%. In Dynamics, set Jitter Size to 25%. In Apple Pencil, set Pressure Opacity to None. Finally, in Properties, set Brush Behavior Maximum Size to 500%, and set Minimum Size to 20%. This creates a multi-dab, multi-color stroke to help you fill in large areas easier. But if you want a single dab stroke, here's how to do that. First, let's duplicate the brush and go into the brush settings for a few changes. Go into Shape, and set Scatter to None, so each dab will follow the same stroke path. Then set Count back down to 1 because, well, single dab, right? Then go into Properties, and turn off Orient to Screen. And now you have a single dab brush that you can use continuously like this, or single tapping, for a one dab touch. And that's your brush! Have fun creating with this one and share them with me on Instagram with the hashtag MakeThisBrush or at MakeThisBrush. Thank you again for all of the support and I'll see you next time. Bye!